All right, guys, I'm going to show you an option from reverse Tilahiva to the dog bar. So I'm going to have so in my reverse Tilahiva here. I'm going to have a nice strong Tilahiva hook. I'm going to have my frames on and I'm going to have my feet here to, to help me extend torque. My right hand is going to be underneath here. And what I'm going to do is that I'm going to extend torque forward until I can get my single. When I get my single from here, I want to reach my right hand over to the opposite knee and I want to start coming. When we come up, we're going to end up in an over under or over under brother. This time it's over under brother. So I make sure I arm wrestle his shin. I walk his leg into the middle, squeeze my knees and I finish. For the sweep guys, I want to make sure I bring tour as much forward as possible. So I'm here, I'm not just kicking a little bit, I'm really trying to extend him up and over with my reverse telehiva. I catch a single and I try to get the knee over here. All right, so I come up. Right when I get the knee, I'm gonna pull it under him and start coming over. From here, just rotate one. We're gonna end up like this, but you know, with momentum, we're probably gonna add more into a one the brother. You can either try to pass or you can just straighten it. Start going for the dog bar and finish. You can do this both from the reverse telehiva or you can time it right when he steps into reverse telehiva. You can kick him forward and connect it. So you, all you have to do is bring his weight forward and catch a double. So you see a reverse telehiva. I have my frames on. I start kicking him forward. Left hand goes for a single, other hand start going for for a double. If you feel like he's a little too far away, then come up, then start reach for it. Pull it to you, rush in towards the one the brother, walk through the middle, and finish the dog bar. That is the reverse Delahiva dog bar.